Good morning and welcome to Midwest Farm Weekly. I'm Melaine Wells and I'm on the site of this year's Farm Technology Days. We're in Clark County in Loyal where they have had, my goodness, some fantastic weather. Chuck Reith is joining me from the executive team. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you. What Thank a you. fantastic show. Talk uh, a little bit about the, the three days. It's almost like the, the field of dreams. You build it, they'll show up and it's just been marvelous. Uh, we've had um, thank the good Lord for the perfect weather, little rain showers here and there, but the people showed up and it was, it's been phenomenal. You've had some fantastic attendance and that means big things because those people are buying food, they're supporting the vendors, and ultimately this show goes back to supporting the community. Talk about how that happens. It has happened many times over. We see before we opened up, the people needed to go get some, a meal or something or get fuel for their vehicles or whatever in our communities and it's just been fabulous. Right, yeah. Everybody's just been thanking me to bring it back in Clare County. It started with two of us and we had looked at the Wood County show and we started there four years ago and this is what it's uh, created as I would say. It's ironic that I was the chairman for the uh, 2005 show and it's the same dates and everything. And we had the 10 horse hitch there 17 years ago also. So deja vu all over, but a good deja vu. And you guys have taken a lot of pride in bringing some new elements to this show. Your concert sold out. Yes, and we're very, very happy about that. It was, um, it was awesome to see all the people keep coming in. It sort of put chills down your spine to see all the traffic coming in. And to showcase our county has just been fabulous. One of my favorite things at Farm Tech is to visit the kids area. Yes. Because to see young people excited about agriculture it makes yes. me excited. And I imagine you feel the same. When I would, uh, I, I, we would uh, have our courtesy cars going and, and delivering people to and from. And I would take another street just to show the people that. And they were just so impressed with the youth area and how everything was designed out. And Cindy and her team has done a marvelous, marvelous job with it. I can't say anything that I, if I had to do anything over, um, it would be very, very minimal, very minimal. Uh, even when you start laying out the mapping, how the traffic is flowing, and everything else has got to go, um, it, it's almost perfect. We haven't even touched on our fabulous host farm. I know they took a lot of pride in the tour. It's Correct. an interactive, hands-on experience. Why is that important? Um, the, the people, you know, we're like three and four or five generations away from the farm already they don't understand how it is for the American farmer anymore, as well as the Wisconsin or central Wisconsin farmers. And when we are the first one to showcase a robotic uh, milking system um, for farm technology days, we had a lot of firsts here in, in Clark County. So we're very proud of that. And a lot of heritage too. What are some of the main commodities and things that this community takes pride in? Uh, probably the, uh, the milk and dairy industry is one of the major ones, but um, the diversification of agriculture is really coming back. We have flocks of uh, chickens laying hens here in Clark County. Our swine population has been growing. And when you get into the fruits and vegetables, as well as our greenhouses, we have many, many greenhouses here. Uh, basically, the plain clothes people but they have some beautiful, beautiful, beautiful um, flowers and plants and everything else. They make uh, me look sick. Well, some fantastic cheese as well in this community. You're going to want to get Farm Technology Days on your calendar. If you visit their website, you can see the show dates for the years ahead. Congratulations on a fantastic show, and thanks for having me. Thank you. Thank you very much, and hello, Green Bay. <laughs>